Streaming live now on News8000.com. You're watching WKBT Lacrosse. This is News 8 Now at Noon. Good afternoon and thanks for watching News 8 Now. I'm Dua Shrar. The city of Mauston has voted to fire city administrator Randy Reed. The city council went into closed session last Tuesday to discuss firing Reed, who was brought on in 2018. The council had tabled the topic to a special session this week. Reeg on Thursday emailed a letter of resignation. Council members then rejected that resignation and announced the decision to terminate Reeg without cause. Reeg had previously admitted to stealing almost $2,000 from the DNR when he worked there in 2003. A Juneau County reporter in August filed felony charges against Reeg for concealment of public records. The nonprofit running a downtown lacrosse all age music venue is dissolving. The reason? Its owner and executive director is accused of grooming teenage volunteers. The Warehouse Alliance Inc. is the nonprofit that runs the all age alcohol free music venue on Lacrosse's Pearl Street. They announced they've stopped all affiliation with building owner and co founder Stephen Harm. One nonprofit board member posted on his Facebook page detailing multiple substantiated reports of grooming allegations against harm. In the post, the member claims that a former volunteer told him that as a minor, she was groomed into becoming a sexual partner with harm after she turned 18. Harm allegedly engaged her, allegedly engaged with her in sexual conversations, showed her pornography and sexually graphic photos, and used sex toys on her while she was clothed. The Warehouse Alliance Board hired an ind independent investigator in the summer, and that investigation finished in early August. Per its Facebook page, the nonprofit encourages anyone who has experienced misconduct to report it. Well, skies on this uh, Wednesday afternoon are looking a little on the cloudy side, especially the further south you are, is where we're seeing the majority of the cloud cover. But as you can see in our satellite picture, we are seeing uh, some clouds beginning to spread their way just a little bit further towards the north here so far. A little bit of some light rain possible underneath some of the thicker clouds near the Prairie du Chien area, but otherwise just expect mixes of sun and clouds everywhere else here so far this afternoon. With our current temperature readings in the 70s, 72 degrees in La Crosse, 75 in Eau Claire. But look at some of that rain cooled air down in Prairie du Chien at 64. That rain is helping to cool things off there a little bit further south there. 74 degrees tonight right now in Bosque Bell. So City Cam 8, you can see mid to high level clouds currently uh, shielding the skies here for the most part. And those cloudy weather conditions that you see will continue through the day today with a warmer afternoon as well with highs picking up into the upper 70s, low 80s, all depending on the cloud cover because uh, we may have to bump down those temperatures a little bit further if we see too much clouds. But uh, otherwise, we'll have that light southerly wind breeze at around 5 to 10 miles an hour. I'll have a check on your four the forecast coming up in a few minutes. I'll let you know if we could see any more upcoming rain chances in the near future. Yesterday was National Voter Registration Day. To commemorate the day, the Lacrosse Area League of Women Voters held a voter registration drive at Lacrosse's main library. The group said this year is an especially important time to check your voter registration. The Wisconsin Election Commission deactivated around 100,000 voter records in August because of a required maintenance process. The deactivations affected voters who have moved to a new address without re-registering. It also could have affected those who haven't voted since the 2020 presidential election. One league volunteer says the registration drive is also focusing on new voters. Some people just never have even voted and they're thinking more about it now because realizing how important the vote is in our democracy, everybody gets to have a say. With four different election days scheduled for 2024, the league says checking your registration will now save you time. Wisconsin has a website where you can check your registration status. You can also register or re-register to vote on that site. We have that link posted on our platforms. You can also register to vote on election day in Wisconsin at your polling place. Construction is underway at Bangor Middle and High School. The school district held a groundbreaking ceremony to celebrate the new facilities. The school will be building a 4,400 square foot weight room and new technical education facilities. The new addition is part of the $24 million referendum passed last November. The district administrator says the new construction gives the students something fun to look forward to. 
when they get to see some of these spaces and the, the, the current designs and the current color schemes and um, the, the weight room equipment, the tech ed equipment, all those things, I think it's just going to be really, really easy to get excited about coming to school and being a part of, uh, of, of those uh, areas. The next phase of referendum construction will begin next summer. The district will be renovating the interior of Bangor Middle and High School. Knowing your constitutional rights, Viterbo University held a free lecture titled Free Speech on College Campuses to help celebrate Constitution Day yesterday. The free lecture was held at Viterbo University's Weber Center for the Performing Arts. It was presented by Alex Mori of the Foundation for Individual Rights and Expression. According to Mori, it's important for students to know their First Amendment rights. She says not only does it help them express themselves, it can also strengthen their education in the long run. And so it's really important to know what your rights are, what you're allowed to say on campus, and what your college or university promises before you go to school. You want to know what rights you have if you are going to a school with good uh, expressive rights. We at FIRE think it's a really good thing to have strong expressive freedoms uh, and that that makes education really much stronger. The event was sponsored by Viterbo University's D.B. Reinhardt Institute for Ethics and Leadership and Leader Ethics. The event was also streamed live on the Viterbo Ethics Facebook page. The members of Downtown Main Street, Inc. will be holding their annual Taste of Downtown event tomorrow. The event helps to bring lacrosse area businesses closer to the community by allowing them to provide samples of their products to attendees. According to a press release by Downtown Main Street, Inc., the event will also have a silent auction and live music. Tickets are $35 for general admission and VIP tickets will cost $50. The event will run from 4 till 7 at the Lacrosse Center. Well, when we come back, a key ingredient for making a grilled cheese is being recalled. And good oral hygiene may improve your chances of surviving head or neck cancer. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Maxwell White, done right. Looking to remodel your bath or shower? Call the professionals at Maxwell White. Our trained and licensed technicians will come to your home and install or replace your unit in as little as one day. Taking care of you and your home with speed and efficiency without sacrificing quality. Let the professionals at Maxwell White tackle your next bathroom project. 7864004. Now offering financing on repairs and projects of all sizes. Stella Jones Corporation in Bangor has immediate openings and wants you to apply. They say this job takes grit, attention to detail, and ability to work as a team. Stella Jones Corporation is where safety matters and wages sustain a comfortable living. If you have what it takes and can stand behind our railroads, then we want you to apply today. $2,500 hiring bonus. One of the best selections of commercial vehicles in the Midwest can be found at Osseo Automotive in Osseo. From medium-duty trucks and vans to super-duty work trucks, cube vans, chassis cabs, and more, you'll find the most popular commercial vehicles from Ford and Chevrolet all in one location. Take advantage of Section 179 tax savings before the end of the year. Get to work with a new commercial truck or van from Osseo Automotive in Osseo. Shop online at osseoautocommercial.com. Meet a doctor who connects all the dots. Oftentimes, people with low back pain, knee pain, or hip pain don't even recognize that it's actually coming from their feet. Their feet? For real? Absolutely, 100%. It can have a domino effect because their foot and their ankle aren't supported properly. Their whole body is out of whack. Getting back into whack? Good feet arch supports could help. Keeping your body in good alignment, that can go a long way. See what we can do for you with a free arch support fitting at the Good Feet Store. Never been invited to a southern fish fry? That's okay. Get Arby's $5 Hush Puppy breaded fish basket and fries. Because Arby's would never not invite you to Arby's. Arby's, we have the meat. Oof, gotta get rid of this. Tell me what? Because it stinks. Have you tried Downy Rinse and Refresh? It helps remove odors three times better than detergent alone. It worked, guys. Yeah. Downy Rinse and Refresh.
U.S. stocks tumbled Tuesday ahead of today's Federal Reserve announcement on interest rates. The Dow dropped 106, the Nasdaq fell 32, and the S&P 500 dipped 9 points. Chanel Call has the latest business headlines from New York. Kraft Heinz is voluntarily recalling more than 80,000 cases of individually wrapped American cheese slices. The company discovered that one of its wrapping machines allowed for thin strips of film to remain on cheese slices after the wrapper is removed, causing a choking hazard. The recall applies to 16-ounce and 3-pound multi-packs of Kraft Singles American Pasteurized Prepared Cheese products with use-by dates in January 2024. Consumers can return the recalled products to the store for an exchange or refund. If you're looking to make some extra cash for the holidays, several major retailers are hiring seasonal workers. Amazon says it wants to bring in roughly 250,000 employees in cities across the U.S. Target is hoping to hire around 100,000 workers and Macy's announced it wants to employ around 38,000 workers. And when it comes to the remote versus in-office debate, just over two-thirds of Americans say they're required to commute more than they'd like. That's according to a new survey from Fiverr. The same percentage of people also believe they could finish their work in four days versus a five-day work week. That's your CBS News Money Watch report. For more, log on to cbsmoneywatch.com. At the CBS Broadcast Center, I'm Chanel Call. Well, that's it for your afternoon consumer news. As we head to break, here is a live look at the New York Stock Exchange. Stay with us. More news is next. Where is the best place for local, fresh, quality meat? The Holman Locker and Meat Market, of course. Our ground beef is on special this month. Choose from 90% lean, 85% lean, and now 80% lean ground beef. Shop local at your Holman Locker and Meat Market. Do the plans for your new home include a fireplace? Is your builder using La Crosse Fireplace Company? Our showroom has over 70 units on display to help inspire you. We'll design more than just your heat and glow fireplace. We'll help you pick the perfect stone, mantle, and hearth, making your heat and glow fireplace the focal point of your new home. Visit our showroom today or call us for your free estimate. La Crosse Fireplace Company, Mormon Cooley Road, because your place is by the fire. Do you need a floor tough enough to withstand your busy family, but still fits in your style and budget? Carpets to Go has what you're looking for. Our Mannington flooring is pet friendly, dent and scratch resistant, waterproof and easy to clean. Mannington Restoration Laminate is also steam mop approved and comes with a 25 year warranty. Mannington Aduramax comes with a lifetime warranty, is designed to dampen sound and comes with microband to help keep your floor 99% cleaner. Stop into Carpets to Go in Onalaska. Home and Locker and Meat Market, your place for fresh, quality, local meat. Now's the time to stock up with our Fall Freezer Filler Bundle. Call and order yours today. Eat healthy, shop local at your Home and Locker and Meat Market, and much, much more. Woo. It's a weird word. It's not even much of a word. It looks funny. It sounds funny. But on Friday night, woo becomes your battle cry, your victory shout, your celebration. Those three letters become the singular word that signifies everything you love about Friday Night Frenzy. Friday Night Frenzy, Friday at 10 on News 8. Get your woo ready. A warning about hypertension and why visiting the dentist could be life-saving down the road. Natalie Brand has a look at some of the day's top health stories. The World Health Organization says 76 million deaths could be averted by 2050 if treatment for high blood pressure improves. A report from the WHO shows about 80% of people with hypertension are not being adequately treated, and half of all people who have the condition don't even know it. Hypertension can lead to stroke, heart attack, kidney damage, and other serious issues. On that same note, the U.S. Preventive Services Task Force is recommending screening for hypertension disorders throughout pregnancy, even in people without chronic hypertension. The report from the Independent Panel of Medical Experts recommends doctors check blood pressure to monitor for related disorders like preeclampsia. 
Having good oral health increases the chance of surviving cancers of the neck and head. According to a study published in the Journal of the National Cancer Institute, people who visited the dentist more than five times in the decade prior to diagnosis had a 60% survival rate 10 years later compared to just 32% for those with no visits. Those are some of the day's top health stories. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Washington. Well, that's it for our medical news today. Here is a look at CityCam 8. Derek is in next with our forecast. Get 50% off lists during the big fall home sale at Slumberland Furniture and one of our best finance sales of the year. Pay no interest for three years. Get this stylish sectional for just $7.99, up to 50% off only at Slumberland Furniture. Save on your next project with 11% off everything at Menards. Create your dream bathroom with sterling bath products that fit your style and budget. Like this Finesse Peak shower door. It's $499.99 after rebate. Get cleaner clothes and softer skin with our great selection of Morton water softeners. Morton's Wi-Fi integration allows for tracking and alerts which put you in control of your water. This 45,000 grain water softener is $599.99 after 11% off. Save big money at Menards. I was stuck. Unresolved depression symptoms were in my way. I needed more for my antidepressant. Raylar helped give it a lift. Adding Raylar to an antidepressant is clinically proven to help relieve overall depression symptoms better than an antidepressant alone. And in Raylar clinical studies, most saw no substantial impact on weight. Elderly dementia patients have increased risk of death or stroke, report unusual changes in behavior or suicidal thoughts. Antidepressants can increase these in children and young adults. Report fever, stiff muscles, or confusion, as these may be life-threatening, or uncontrolled muscle movements, which may be permanent. High blood sugar, which can lead to coma or death, weight gain, and high cholesterol may occur. Movement dysfunction and restlessness are common side effects. Stomach and sleep issues, dizziness, increased appetite, and fatigue are also common. Side effects may not appear for several weeks. I didn't have to change my treatment. I just gave it a lift. Ask about Raylar and learn how AbbVie can help you save. Get 50% off lists during the big fall mattress sale at Slumberland. Incredible deals like a twin mattress for just $99 or our own private brand Slumbercrest as low as $299. Plus Sealy Posturepedic mattresses marked way down only at Slumberland. The Board Store Home Improvements. Everyday low prices on bathroom remodels for seniors and families. Contact us today for a prompt free estimate. Friday Night Frenzy. Friday at 10 on News 8. Looking at partly cloudy skies here behind me from City Cam A to in at La Crosse. And as you can see, our temperatures in La Crosse are at 72 degrees with winds out of the south at around six miles an hour. Meanwhile, if you're in Eau Claire, 75 degrees with some of those sunshine and also a little bit of some clouds out there as well with south winds at around five miles an hour. Current temperatures stand uh, mainly into the mid 70s. One of the cooler exceptions is Prairie Sheen now at 65. That's some of the rain cooled air effects being felt there from uh, from some of the uh, showers that moved through here earlier today. 75 is the temperature are now in Black River Falls and 76 currently in Sparta. So as we take a look at your planner, we're going to turn cloudier as the day goes on today with temperatures at around 8 degrees at 3. Then we drop down just a little bit to the upper 70s by around 5 o'clock here with uh, temperatures around 73 degrees by 7 o'clock here this evening underneath some of those cloudy skies. High temperatures today, low 80s here across the area with a high of 82 in La Crosse, 84 today in Eau Claire and a high of 81 this afternoon if you're in Winona. So we're looking at uh, a little unseasonable warm for this time of the year really depends on the amount of clouds though to limit that daytime heating because if we see more we'll see those temperatures in the 80s if not the clouds stick around probably a little cooler we'll keep our eyes on that you can see some of those showers near the Prairie du Chien area currently as we speak widening out the view here a little bit so you can see the reason why we got that south wind out ahead of this trough of low pressure back towards the west that's helping to increase the moisture not to mention we did have a bit of a warm front which is now uh, transferred more towards a stationary boundary position to our north that system moved through here earlier today and that did bring us some warmer temperatures for us to work with here this morning and that will contribute to later in the day but that really just depends on the amount of cloud cover though that we see here throughout the day if the clouds stick around as forecast we may be slightly cooler we'll keep our eyes on that slight chance of a shower otherwise those thick cloudy uh, skies will continue throughout the day and also as we head into tonight heading into early tomorrow morning skies will begin to clear out here a little bit slight chance of a shower possible in some spots but otherwise expect mostly sunny conditions really 
throughout the rest of the day tomorrow. I'm watching for a couple of showers, maybe a couple of storms firing up near Eau Claire up towards the Chippewa Valley heading into tomorrow evening before dissipating as we head into tomorrow night. Here's a check on your eight day forecast and you can see we got highs in the low 80s uh, through Friday. Keep our eyes on that a little unseasonably warm there. First day of fall, by the way, is on Saturday and we'll kick it off mostly sunny with that high of 78 degrees. Watching for our next system that could move in to give us a chance of rain and storms on Sunday. And again, also as we head into early next week on Monday. At the same time, it looks like our temperatures start to cool down right after fall begins too next week. Can't wait for sweater yeah. weather. <laughs> sweater weather. Sweater it's got a nice weather. Sweater weather. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks, Derek. All right. Well, when we come back, a new sp green space is open to the public. We'll take a look at the new urban green space next to the Western Technical College Horticulture Center. That's coming up next. If you've been injured in a car accident, call Schwabel Getz and Sieben today. Schwabel Getz and Sieben was in clear communication with me every step of the way. There was a ton of paperwork to complete. Not only are they taking care of the legal aspects, they're listening to you and they're showing empathy and they've helped so many people. And so they know the journey and they're ready to walk it with you. You need an experienced attorney on your side. Schwabel Getz and Sieben. So this is where the wizard gets his power. I can do it. It's committable. Pokety pokety. It's committable. What the? You want diddy diddy. Give me that before you hurt yourself. You're using it backwards. Gesundheit. After 32 years, you should know better. Maybe I should just stick to what I'm good at and leave the magic to the wizard? Let the crew at American Home Fireplace and Patio put the magic in your home. Doing it right for over 32 years. News 8 Now and Dairyland Power Cooperative present Our Community Cares. The Big Brothers Big Sisters Golf for Kids' Sake takes place on Friday, September 22nd at Fox Hollow in Barry Mills. Poll prizes, food, drinks, and raffles. Proceeds will benefit the Sports Buddies and Group Mentoring Programs. It's the 18th Annual Chaseburg Soul Burner. Walk with other passionate cancer fighters to fight for a world without cancer. Saturday, September 23rd at Chaseburg Village Park. For more information on these events or if you'd like to submit an event, visit news8000.com. <laughs> Fanati's on Main Street in La Crosse is the only place you'll find this kind of variety, including our totally scrumptious caramel apples, juicy, tart, and smothered in creamy, buttery caramel. Fanati's caramel apples, oh, uh, yeah, they're that good. No, no, I'm not leaving. It's Fanati's. This is the best place ever. Oh, that's the practice is wait. Join us for Taste of Downtown, Thursday, September 21st. You're watching News 8 Now. Expect more. The La Crosse community now has a place to clear their head downtown. Western Technical College cut the ribbon on its urban green space. It's located next to the Horticulture Center. The president of the college says the horticulture program approached the school about building the green space about five years ago. The green space is an area that everyone is welcome to use. President Stanford says it's a space that's great for relaxing during the day. Green space is just what we need downtown, is to be able to have something that we all can, you know, kind of kind of sit back and enjoy and not just look at concrete walls. And so I think this is really good for people to actually use to clear their head so that they're just the best participants at whatever they have to do to make a living. Stanford added that there will be benches, they just haven't arrived yet. The green space even has electrical access during the day. Well, stay with us. We have one more check of your forecast when we return. Craft Barn offers a unique shopping experience for your home and garden. We have items for every season. Check out our large variety of greeting cards, candles, gifts, jewelry, and so much more. We also have the largest selection of cookie cutters around. See for yourself. Visit the Craft Barn today. Come and get the very best in home exteriors at the lowest price during the fall home show only at the board store. Always your home for high quality at lower prices. We bring you superior products installed by our exceptional team of carpenters, plumbers, and electricians. Vinyl siding, seamless steel siding, soffit fascia, and gutters. Superior products, superior installation, lower prices at the fall home show only at the board store home improvements. Windows, doors, siding, decks, bathroom, kitchen, flooring, pergolas, fall home show, the board store home improvements. Don't miss it. Where there's a flooded basement, there's a solution. 
Where there are wet spots or musty smells, there's an answer. Where wood damage or dry rot is stealing home value, there's an expert, American Waterworks. For wet basements, wood damage, and effects of dry rot, American Waterworks professional crack repair, waterproofing, sump pumps, and vapor barriers provide long-lasting solutions to tough problems. Wherever moisture problems surface, there's an answer, American Waterworks. Schedule your free inspection and estimate today. It's the biggest event in King Furniture's history. A complete and total liquidation of all in-stock items in our store. Shop over $2 million of quality name brand furniture priced for immediate liquidation. This will be a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to save as never before on living room, dining room, bedroom furniture, and more. When each and every piece of furniture has been sold, King Furniture will shut down for 30 to 60 days for a complete and total renovation. Don't miss the King Furniture Total Liquidation Sale. Going on now. The Craft Barn offers a unique shopping experience for your home and garden. Enjoy our no-maintenance outdoor patio furniture with the option to customize. The Craft Barn, specializing in that perfect piece to make your home complete. See for yourself. Visit us today. Friday Night Frenzy, Friday at 10 on News 8. You get alerts every day for almost everything. I mean, really, pick a topic, get an alert for it. And most of the time, they aren't that important. But if there's one alert worth paying attention to, it's an alert day from First Warn Weather. Alert days aren't just for severe weather, but for disruptive weather, weather that might mess with your day. So when you see this, look out for this. It's one more way the News 8 Now First Warn Weather team keeps you safe and ahead of the storm. Highs in the low 80s uh, through Friday under mainly cloudy conditions, but tomorrow looks a little bit sunnier, however, between today and through Friday. Now, as we take you into this weekend, we are looking at a mainly cloudy start for the first official day of fall on Saturday. A chance of showers and thunderstorms, or at least a better chance that is for Sunday and also into Monday of next week. At the same time, our high temperatures start to cool down a little bit just in time uh, for the fall season there. Low temperatures into the 50s and low 60s. Looking forward to those yeah. low 60s. Yeah, at least for the morning lows, that's going to feel nice out there too. And I'm excited to kind of feel like the more like the fall season too. Absolutely. It makes yeah. more sense to drink hot coffee in that weather. Yeah, exactly. Well, thank you for watching News 8 Now at noon. We'll see you back here later today at 5, 6, and 10. Have a wonderful Wednesday.